today I'm going to do a complete DVD collection of video. Uh, this is just going to be DVDs. I'll have the Blu-ray uh, video coming tomorrow and the uh, 4K collection coming on Sunday. So let's get to it. So first on DVD I have The Bucket List. I have not seen this in so long. I don't even know why I still have it because I don't watch it. And I got Percy Jackson and the Olympians, The Lightning Thief, uh, the first film here. Um, grew up on the books, so had to get this one. Percy Jackson, Sea of Monsters, the second one. Um, this one was my favorite book out of the series, um, so cool that they made another one. Next I have this Superman 5 film collection. Next I have the Spongebob Squarepants movie in this nice yellow case. Uh, definitely something I grew up with, so I have that. And then I have the Spongebob movie Sponge Out of Water. This was the sequel. Next I have the Flashpoint Paradox um, animated film here. Next I have the Ghost Rider collection. This comes with Ghost Rider and Spirit of Vengeance. So both films there in this nice little package. I got the director's cut of Daredevil. This is the 2003 film. Justice League Dark. Um, got this because of Matt Ryan's Constantine. Really liked him. So Eli Ross, The Green Inferno. This is the director's cut here on DVD. Um, I wanted to see it, so I got it. Cinematic classic Speed Racer here. And then the Batman the movie. This is the Adam West film from 1966. Next I have Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. This is the Johnny Depp Tim Burton film. Phineas and Ferb the movie Across a Second Dimension. Then here is a double feature of The Mask and Son of the Mask on DVD. The Mask of course classic. Have not seen Son of the Mask in quite so long and I don't think I'll try it again because uh, I've heard bad things. Have the Black Calderon here on DVD. Um, interesting Disney film if you haven't seen it. Journey to the Center of the Earth. Uh, this was another fun one when I was younger, so I got that. And it actually was in the two pack with Journey to the Mysterious Island. Got that at Walmart, them together. Then I have Goosebumps, who doesn't love Goosebumps? Um, it's kind of a fun movie, I suppose. I have Electra here with this slipcover. I found this at a thrift store. And here is the triple feature of the Punisher movies. Here is M. Night Shyamalan's The Visit. And from Shot Factory, you have Captain America um, and Captain America 2, Death Too Soon. These are the movies from the 70s, and I think they are quite boring. Next, I have the Despicable Me franchise here on DVD. So, all four of them so far, and all in these nice slip covers here. Um, yeah, pretty fun films. I really like the second two, or the first two, not so much these two, but I have them. I have Live, Die, Repeat, or no, it's called Edge of Tomorrow, but you know. Um, this is getting a 4K release soon, very excited. Lights Out, this was a fun film. Really likes the short film, so it was cool to um, see this. X-Men Origins Wolverine with the slipcover Snowpiercer. Definitely a fun uh, science fiction film. Really like this one. Black Swan, definitely a classic. Comes in this um, like translucent white uh, case here. Next I have Gulliver's Travels, the Jack Black movie. Um, I read the book when I was younger closer to when this movie came out, so, uh, and I like Jack Black, but I haven't seen this one in a long time. Southpaw, pretty good Jake Gyllenhaal film, uh, pretty depressing, for sure. Then I got all three Taken films on DVD. Then I got Nonstop here with this slipcover, another Liam Neeson favorite. And then I have the Ryan Reynolds film, uh, The Voices. Speaking of, I got R.I.P.D., which at the time was a pretty cool concept, but I haven't seen it really in so long that I don't have an opinion on it. I have The Gift here, the um, Joel Edgerton film. Then I got this 8 film collection of Friday the 13th. 
Um, it was like 10 bucks at Walmart during Black Friday. Uh, I've only seen the first two, didn't like them, so I didn't continue. But uh, no, I did watch the third one in 3D, I think. Got this film before we go. This is a Chris Evans directorial debut, I think. And then I have the trilogy of Diary of a Wimpy Kid. I uh, grew up on these when I was a kid, so I have all three of them. Next, I have the Scorsese film Hugo. Read this book when I was younger, uh, so I have that. Rise of the Guardians from DreamWorks. The original Cloverfield into the kind of the monster movies. X-Men Days of Future Past, the row cut on DVD. Um, like I said, I like um, different cuts. The Scream Trilogy here on DVD, and then Scream 4 on DVD. I have both Fantastic Four films on DVD, and then I have Fan Four Stick. The Giver, another book I read when I was younger, so I have the film. Uh, the Hateful Eight, definitely a great Quentin Tarantino film, and probably one of my favorite films of all time, uh, Thank You for Smoking. Uh, I recommend if you haven't seen it. The Emoji Movie, <laughs> The Interview, I have The Ring here, the, oh, I got the full screen edition. <laughs> That's a shame. Got Scooby-Doo and Scooby-Doo 2 Monsters Unleashed. Uh, I love Scooby-Doo, so, you know, gotta get this two-pack. Puss in Boots. Um, yeah, I like some of the Shrek movies, so, you know. Howard the Duck, pretty self-explanatory, I'm sure. The Guilt Trip, and I got the Iron Giant here on DVD. Next from the Criterion Collection, I have Seven Samurai here on DVD. Then I have the Eight Film Collection of A Nightmare on Elm Street, definitely one of my favorite horror films of all time. Uh, Birdman, uh, which won some Oscars, I believe, a couple years ago. Spy, thought it was a pretty good comedy. True Story, I actually read this book and I really like this book. Um, the movie, not so much. And then I have Constantine, the complete first season or complete series here on DVD. And then I have the complete series of The Twilight Zone. I'm just gonna zoom through these uh, TV shows. Agent Carter, the complete first season, the first four seasons of Spongebob, the Batman serials from the 40s, How to Get Away with Murder, seasons one and two, Scream, the TV series, the first season, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., season one and two, uh, the first seven seasons of Arrow, I don't have season eight, that's the only one I don't have, and the first three seasons of The Flash. Then I have the first five seasons of The Blacklist on DVD, plus the Blacklist uh, Redemption season one. Um, this show went downhill pretty fast, so I think I'm done collecting those. I have The Strain, the complete series. Uh, this one was pretty cool. Really liked this one. Season one of The Last Man on Earth. And I guess this is a movie, I guess, Vixen, but this was like a web, like shorts and they compiled it together. Then I have the three seasons of Wonder Woman, the Linda Carter series, the 1990s Flash complete series, and then I have the three seasons of Batman, the Adam West TV show. Anyway, thanks for watching. That was my DVD uh, collection video. I got more videos coming up this next week. Uh, Monday, I should be getting the Batman in, so stay tuned for that unboxing. I'll see you guys on the next video.